And I can say now that it gives me great pleasure, something, a song that means a great deal to me, uh, to do Arnold Lane. Yeah, so one of the seven inch singles is a version of Arnold Lane that we did, Nick, Rick and I, and one or two other people um, at the Barbican. It was after Sid died in 2006. It was a tribute evening. It was great. We have Dave and Nick and Rick. Pink Floyd. Seven inch singles when I was a child, actually, 10 inch ones originally, which were um, 78s. Was the, the very first single I got, I think, was Rock Around the Clock on a 78, which got broken by someone sitting on it. So, part of the package, there's um, a couple of singles that have been released. One is Arnold Lane. We wanted a, a fresh image on that, you know, not, not something from the past. And so I very simply created a, a, an image which was washing on a washing line. You know, when you listen to the lyrics of Arnold Lane, which is about a deviant who steals women's underwear from back gardens, you know, I wanted something that was very simple and didn't dwell on that subject, but just had that kind of essence to it. And it's just a graphic picture. It's nothing complicated. And we made use of the bowler hat. And the bowler hat, of course, comes from the video that was released way back uh, of Arnold Lane. I love the rehearsal, just in a room, and we haven't played for a while, you know, and it's just Nick tapping his sticks on the back of a chair, and a nice little clip. The show was good fun. Uh, the airship is 196 feet long, 67 feet high from the, from the ground to the top of the fin, and weighs about 7,000 pounds without the helium. Just now, it weighs about 40 kilos. All sorts of people in record companies and management companies and promoters come up with all sorts of ideas and um, baffling really. But uh, the thing I remember most about it was going for a ride in it over Miami Beach and looking down from it at the beach in Miami and seeing all these people swimming in the first sort of hundred yards of water and all the sharks swimming amongst them. If the people who were swimming could see what I could see from, you know, a couple of hundred feet above, they'd have been out of that water like a shot. <laughs> <laughs> 